Josh here with Janie Meats. Uh, I thought I'd hop on here and do a video to kind of let everybody know what's going on. But uh, we're planting some soybeans. We finished up corn today and got the planter switched over and got it in the field. Kind of get it setting up. That way it's all ready to go tomorrow and we can kind of hammer down and go. But uh, this field is pretty cool. Uh, last fall it was corn. So we harvested the corn and then we put a fence around it and graze the cows on it. So uh, the cows were grazing until about middle of January once the snow got on the ground and it got kind of wet underneath. Uh, we had to stop grazing, but they did have a couple good months of uh, grazing, so that was good. Um, this is something new to us. We really have never no-tilled into corn stalks that were ran on cows. We've done it many times, just regular corn stalks that didn't have any grazing done with them and whatnot. But this is the first time we've really ever no-tilled anything into it so it's going really really well and the cool thing about the cows running on this is if you look down there you can see a lot of bare dirt um, so that what that tells me is those cows came through they tramped the stalks down into the dirt uh, once they started to rot because they're down in the dirt they'll rot faster so that'll break down the corn stalks it'll give you more available nutrients out of those corn stalks and it just makes it so much nicer to plant because there's more bare dirt um, it dries out more consistently and plants nicer so there's a lot of hoof prints which i was a little concerned about um, one because it kind of maybe leaves it a little too rough so when we come in and combine it the combine maybe not quite cut quite as well and as low um, and two is i thought it was going to be really hard but it's actually planting really nice and once the planter goes through it is kind of smoothing it out a bit and uh, which is really nice so this is really new to us like I said I know they do it a lot in the Midwestern states South Dakotas um, Iowa is out in there where they typically grow a lot of corn and they'll graze a lot of cows out on them so um, going pretty well hopefully it works It'll save us a tillage tool because basically the cows did the tillage for us by mixing the stalks into the dirt. Um, so let them do the work. They spread the manure for us and life is great. So anyways, hope you're all having a good uh, good long weekend. Like I said, we're out here. We're getting, the, getting beans in and hopefully keep going. So take care.